good, YouTube. It's your boy Dev back again for another first listen. Y'all know who that is right there. Today, we are back for another Miamda Monday where I listen to a new artist that I've not listened to, whether it be in the rain, the snow, on Mars, on Earth, underground, in China. Happens to be in China right now. You know what I'm saying? In Europe, no matter where. This is where I kind of go into a new artist, man, finding the diamonds in the dirt because I once tell you guys, man, Kendrick Lamar was once a diamond in the dirt. Not everybody can be, you know what I'm saying, TDE's top dog. No pun intended. Now, my thing is, look, when you guys come to me with your music, man, and or, or not even y'all come to me with your music or whenever people actually come to me with suggestions, I, I, I hope that somebody that puts, you know, craft into their work. Obviously, I'm not going to bash them like it was Uzi or Cardi. But I'm going to listen to them with an open mind and also give my cons and pros of what I like about the song and what I dislike. So I tell you guys that when you guys you know, throw me some artists, just just be mindful that I'm going to be, you know, I'm going to be an open book. Because that's something I don't do, man. I don't fake some shit. I'm definitely not here trying to fake it. You know, I'm definitely being me who I am. That's kind of what I do, man. So the track is called Death Mania Ecstasy, but it's spelled X-T-A-C-Y. I got a little background from somebody. They said this shit was performed in China. During Corona. That's crazy. Let go. Hella snow. To be in China. I, I didn't even know it's snow in China. Bitch, while I pray for the Lex and I get that thing when I'm at a successor. What have I been through? The sins are habitual, the worst is to hit you. And I just gotta get up, get us some money. I just wanna drive this spot and make it look funny. Whoa, smooth ride rap in my bit too. Super dressy when I call and neglect you. Yeah. Baby, just wanted to leave you to please you. Cruising down the highway, I'm in free view. Never come and miss a mind. You just wanna dive around, but you flipping dimes, huh? Let me really run off to states, maybe befriend some. I don't ever have to relate. I gotta spaz out when I'm on the mic. Hey. I low key, I, I, you know, for me, man, I always tell you guys, like, I love animals. I, I see how I was gonna make a joke. The shirt said FTP. I was about, I was like, that's flight. Well, nah, I was, I, I'm gonna keep that joke to myself. But I like, you know, you got a little alternative thing going for you, man. This is not your standard rap. You got, you still rapping, but it's alternative rap. And I feel like right now, this is kind of the best time to explore in that region, man. Especially if you want to kind of just continue that because we got artists like Tyler Creator doing his thing. Uh, Mac Miller was doing the Funk Soul thing. Our Peter Mark Mac Miller, Anderson Pock is also another artist that kind of you know dabbles with the rap Funk Soul. So for you to kind of just have this alternative kind of sound, man, like this can be something that you can work on. Uh, you know, it's in China. I didn't even know it snowed in China to be all. Actually, I lied. I saw Mulan. The shit, it definitely snowed in China. What the fuck am I talking about? But you got the Mastiffs and shit and all the motherfucking beasts and shit in the background. Uh, the goats or whatever kind of beast that is in motherfucking China. That's kind of cool though. So let me really get my ass out this quickly The misfits, they live in their minds A little yak Run with me, feed me the song song So we all know the lead, feeling your pressure I don't want no company, just let me go But what's it like when life is free, huh? Kitty, I'm loving the cultural fit In me lips, baby, even though you fail to exist I wanna be legit in my own hometown Hold it down till money is the only sound What? Run to the bay, run in this main Never conform to what they say When they living on their own is the principle I gotta make back with the I like that. I like I like the transition, bro. Like, and that's what I'm talking about, man. Like, not a lot of people is fucking with shit like this. But you gotta be different to kind of listen to shit like this. You know what I'm saying? You also gotta be different to create shit like this. 
off and my wrist damn is crazy you trying to get the permanent take now but you just really wanted to prop a state for the tomato space best of the maho day but we always try to just stop the slow you know me like i'm seeing through my feelings and all i know it's so serious your vision is blood and i ain't giving up for nothing the feelings are strong but we gon' gonna really ride through maybe we die soon in cemetery feel a vision with the buzz that is all scary i never stress you i gotta just protect the fairy i want to feel the human touch because it's so revealing uh, right in the beat hot in defeat man you just gotta try to be discreet because you globe trying with the only camera of a light popping his pills now up in the passage side that's so fire bro that's actually filmed in shali raw filmed in shali raw tibet that's pretty fire bro like this is what i gotta say about it man like first of all i gotta say man i love the production like the production was fire like that's 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 some production that definitely is more of my taste i know a lot of my listeners man they love their trap beats and they definitely love their you know mumble shit i get that um as a music listener of the last four or five years, you know, definitely going into it more than I've... I bet, well, let me, let me stop. I've listened to music over the last 20 years of my life, right? But as I started this channel, man, you definitely kind of hear different sounds. And I've definitely learned about new things about myself and what I like and what I dislike. I think that right here, man, kind of having these these synths going and a little the, the, those spacey sounds. And, you know, still kind of having a rap sound to it. But just kind of just a lot electronic rap, exactly how I said. Like there's a lot of success with you guys see somebody like Tyler the Creator, who, you know, after Flower Boy, you know, kind of just you know reinventing himself and then coming out with Igor, which I felt like was mostly like electronic pop rap, whatever you want to label it as. It still was okay because he's Tyler the Creator. He's gonna have a fan base. He's gonna receive that well. Now somebody like you, man, Death Maniac, man, I like this. I love the visuals as well. Filmed in Sri Lanka, you said it was Sri Lanka. I saw at the end of this China. Which I thought that was cool, man. You had the wilderness going, you know, all the animals, the both the mastiffs. I think those dogs are called mastiffs. Very vicious doges. They're big as hell. And then having, like, you snow, you riding on the yak. I thought that was pretty cool, man. And then just the, the transition between the middle, um, the middle of the song. I love that part where the beat dropped and everything kind of just felt like you were going on acid. The visuals were going crazy. See, not a lot of artists, man. It's in this view, this, this shit only got 1,200 views. And it sucks because, again, you can have a fire-ass song, right? But the fact that no one is pushing you shit, the fact that you're not popular enough, that's the hard part about any influencer, anything that comes with music, shit, even with business. If no one knows your product, if no one knows who you are, and no one can see that, then you're going to stay in the dirt forever. So I feel like right here, man, with you making this track, man, uh, people, two couple people, look, I'm just saying, a couple people referred this to me, and why am I still getting hit? Okay, um, apparently somebody left my classic gill. But I just want to say, man, like, for me, it's just why, like, I don't understand, man, why some artists blow and why some don't. Actually, I do understand. It's all about love. <laughs> like, y'all really don't understand when I tell you guys that. It's all about love. Luck meaning that you can be as talented as you want to be, but if your music is not getting pushed out, if no one can see your music, then what? what's the point? What? What is? What really is happening for you, right? Like, what... Like, what can you do except grind hard and try to get like my thing is, I always say you work hard for opportunity. You don't work hard to be successful, like directly successful. You work hard to create opportunity to then be successful. That's what I say. When you make like tracks like this, man, I hopefully mo hopefully people can see this. Hopefully some of my fan base can fuck with you and dive into your music. But it's hard, man. Like you definitely got to. And it's crazy because then you got to pay. People don't understand. Nothing is free. Like clout isn't free, right? Like, everybody always likes to say, like, you should be free. You should be doing it for people. You should be doing it for free. Like, everything. Like, nothing is free in this world. So, like, if you want to be next to, like, a, a big-name artist, like, Gunna gonna run you, like, 50K. Drake's gonna run you, like, 100K for a feature. T-Pain's gonna run you back in the day, 20K for a feature. It's, it sucks, man. Like, it sucks because talent is talent. And not everybody can go into escape free. So, I'm gonna keep it like that, man. Get in the comment box below, man. Let me know what you think about this track, Death Maniac. I loved it personally, man. I love your transitions. I love your hard work through it because this definitely looks better than most videos today. Definitely feels like you put a lot of effort into the song, but sometimes effort is not just enough in this music industry. It could be a cold ass word out there, just like a video, man. We're gonna get a comment box below, man. Let me know. <laughs> We're gonna keep it like that. Get a comment box below, man. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to follow me on social media, join me here, and until the next time, it's Boy Dev. Like always.